lung cancer is the fourth most common cancer in India. It's the fourth most common cause of cancer deaths in our country. The causes of lung cancer are tobacco smoking, asbestos exposure, air pollution, and passive smoking and secondhand smoking. All efforts must be made to stop tobacco smoking because it's a preventable cause of death. The symptoms of lung cancer are a chronic cough which is not improving, breathing difficulty, chest pain, blood in the sputum, and if the disease spreads to other organs like the bones, patients may have back pain. If it goes to the brain, they may present with fits or seizures or severe headache or weakness of the limbs. If it spreads to the liver, they can have pain in the abdomen or jaundice. Are there any screening methods for lung cancer? Yes, low-dose CT scan is a method to detect early lung cancers to be done annually in heavy smokers. Diagnosis of lung cancer is based on a biopsy. Biopsy is a needle test where we put a needle into the suspected part and obtain a tissue. If cancer cells are seen, lung cancer is diagnosed. To stage lung cancer, to see where all it has spread, we do something called imaging. That is, could be an X-ray, could be a CT scan or a PET scan or an MRI. This is to see where all the disease has spread, based on which it is staged from stage 1 to 4, 1 being early disease and stage 4 means it is advanced disease. Lung cancer usually spreads to the brain, bone, opposite lung and liver. The treatment for lung cancer for stages 1 and 2, surgery is a treatment if possible followed by chemotherapy. For stage 3, it is chemo radiation and for stage 4 is systemic therapy. Systemic therapy is a treatment which works all over the body. It could be chemotherapy, it could be targeted therapy, it could be immunotherapy or oral therapy in the form of TKI which is called tyrosine kinase inhibitors. Coming to stage 4 lung cancer, the treatment has changed over the last few decades and the treatment differs from smokers and non-smokers. Once we do a biopsy, we do certain molecular tests called EGFR, ALK, ROS, PDL1, etc. These tests usually take 10 to 14 days to come. Non-smokers have a high chance of these tests coming positive. If these reports are positive, then the patients can avoid chemotherapy and then can be put on tablets called a TKI or on immunotherapy. For example, patients who are stage 4 lung cancer, who are non-smokers, who are EGFR positive, are usually put on Jeftinib or Erlotinib or Osimertinib. Those patients who are stage 4 lung cancers, who are ALK positive, are put on crizotinib or seritinib or electinib. Those patients who are PDL1 positive can receive immunotherapy. By these medications, we can avoid chemotherapy and the chemotherapy side effects. And the average survivals for these patients who are called driver mutation positive patients is usually more than 3 to 4 years. Broadly, the types of lung cancer include small cell and non-small cell lung cancer and in non-small cell, adenocarcinoma, squamous carcinoma and large cell carcinoma. So finally, the take-home points are lung cancer is a very common cancer. We should abstain from smoking. Early detection is the key. Early cases, surgery or radiation followed by chemo is the treatment of choice. In advanced cases, you have tablets and immunotherapy now which can avoid chemotherapy in those patients who are non-smokers and who are driver mutation positive.